Welcome to Kurt's Home Living. Shorts. I'm out here ready to pick me some tomatoes and some basil to go with my dinner. Let's get some of these leaves. Got some purple basil too. Those alone, still young. Basil, anything new? Don't need anything else? Don't need any mint. Tell you what, let's get some of these green cilantro seeds. Just a couple of them. Add a little pop. Cilantro seeds, some tomato, and some basil. <clears throat> Give a little bit more basil. <clears throat> These are the items that I'll be using to cook today's meal, including my lacinato kale, basil, fresh coriander green seeds, and my fresh picked tomatoes. I put equal parts olive oil and butter in the pan. I season my shrimp with salt, lemon pepper, and lightly dusted it with flour. One minute on each side in the oil and butter mixture. I took the shrimp out, add a little bit more oil, and added my garlic, onions, my green coriander seeds, basil, dried chili peppers, and dried shrimp. I sauteed for about three or four minutes. I then added the white, balsamic, and basil vinaigrette, a splash of milk, veggie stock, a little bit more butter, and let it reduce. Once the reduction, I added the shrimp back in, a few whole bay leaves, and tossed it for a couple of minutes. And then I added the Pinier pasta, turned off the fire, and tossed it for another minute or so. Then I quickly stir fried the kale, some of the red onions, cucumber, Brussels sprouts, little garlic, leeks, and tossed a little basil in the veggies. Ah, uh, finished product, cooked to perfection. Shrimp was nice and tender, the penne, chickpea pasta turned out pretty good, and the stir fry was delectable. Delicious. Thanks for watching Kurt's Home Living Shorts.